as winter begins, we're here at the Nen Washes. It's our first time here. If your luck's in, it's a good place to see all sorts of raptors, including both marsh and hen harriers, and also common cranes, which I've yet to get any decent footage of. So let's see what the day brings. Well, not much so far. Looking down into the dike, there's some fish, a stripey, so they could be perch, and looking out across the washes, we've got a pair of gypsy ponies, and looking way out on the horizon, we've got a mass of birds when a longer lens, especially when the sun comes out, reveals that they're lapwing. And then we're joined by a solitary carrion crow. We were just thinking about seeking shelter from the ferocious wind blowing across the washes when suddenly this large flock of winter thrushes flies in. They're field fair. Our first decent view of these beautiful winter visitors for this autumn and winter. As far as we can see, they are all field fare. There are no red wings among them. You'll often find red wings in field fare in mixed flocks. Well, it doesn't look as though the Nen washes are going to offer much more today, so we're going to move a little way down the road to King's Dyke Reserve. Here we are in the hide at King's Dyke. It's a private reserve and you have to apply for membership. And like last time, there's plenty of reed buntings on view. Really good views of these attractive birds. We also have chaffinches. This is a female on the feeder. And the usual selection of tits, including long tail tits this time. Moorhen ambles by, giving us good views of those specially adapted feet with those splayed toes designed for walking on vegetation, such as water lily pads. Also on view are cormorant, teal, these sleeping by the water's edge but always keeping a beady eye out for predators. And looking in the reeds, a pure white duck, maybe a, an escapee from a farm or a, just a mallard hybrid. It's not an albino because its eyes are black. And like the last time we were here, there's plenty of magpie here today. This one pecking away among the fungi. Also black-headed gull. Cute. And we were just getting ultra close-up views of this pruning swan when a welcome visitor flies in. This male kingfisher. Unfortunately, only the briefest of views. But it's always a thrill to see and film a kingfisher. So I'll leave you with that. I'll see you next time.